Richard. I'm Lauren Sargent. I'm a co-founder at uh, Stories, Inc. This is my co-founder, Scott Thompson, in the picture. Uh, and today, uh, I'll be walking through um, three different case studies of uh, clients we've had that we've created story-based content for recruitment marketing and employer branding purposes. Um, I have really, uh, whew, I've really committed to this uh, choose-your-own-adventure theme. So uh, that involves some audience participation. Uh, and uh, I'll get to that a little bit later, but know that it's, it's going to be highly, hopefully highly interactive, and if for some reason it's not, I have a plan <laughs> to show you content that's pretty interesting. So I, I'm gonna start with a story. Uh, I know that recruiters are busy. I used to be one. I was one for eight years. And um, one particular day, I had three final round interviews that had you know like six interviews each, plus phone screens and everything that you do on top of your you know, a crazy day on top of your usual crazy days. And at the end of the day, I was just spent. Uh, I was emotionally, mentally ready to go home. Like, it had been a really hard day. So I took the metro home, and then my husband walked in the door, and he said, oh, I'm so surprised to see you. Where's your car? So <laughs> I took the metro home, forgetting I drove to work. So I know you're busy. I know what it's like. I remember. <laughs> So my goal for this presentation is to make getting started in creating content based on employee stories easy for you. Um, the good news is, as recruiters, you already know how to do this work. You already know how to talk to people about what's really important to them and get them to tell you what's important to them. You also already know what your candidates want to hear and what's special about your organization. So uh, you have the skills to do this already. And hopefully I'll make it easier, too, with some tips that you can, uh, you can take home. Okay, so choose your own adventure. This is, we're gonna try it out. The first is that you pick the order. So we're gonna talk uh, about CVS, Dell, and Sodexo. Specifically CVS, we took a team approach to developing content. At Dell, we took a, we call like a deep dive approach, which means we developed content just for interns or just for veterans. And uh, for Sodexo, we did a culture sweep. So that's interviewing people all over the, co the company in all different positions um, to create a lot of content. And then the second part, that's gonna last about half the presentation. The second part, um, you guys can tell me some of the recruitment challenges you're having, and I'll show you examples of content we've created that may have addressed that, uh, that challenge. So some examples of recruitment issues you're facing might be how do I talk about where I work when I can't talk about where I work? So that's, that could be common for this room. You can't you know, talk about all the cool projects that your company is doing because it's in a cleared environment. Or um, how about hiring manager interviews? How do we get our hiring managers to talk and then what does that look like um, for candidates? So those are some ideas, but of course, I will be soliciting more from the audience if during the presentation you think, oh, I wonder how I might develop content around this specific um, recruitment situation. Happy to, if we have an example, share it on the fly. Oh. Sorry guys, so you pick the order. Um, does anyone have, uh, let's sh see a show of hands, who wants to see Sodexo first? Okay, who wants to see CVS first? <laughs> who wants to see uh, Dell? Oh, it's like evenly split. Okay, so I'll just do what's easy for me then, since there wasn't an overwhelming